Javante Davis's trainer, Calvin Ford, saying the same thing I've been saying. Hey, Ryan Garcia, stop talking about that rehydration clause. He said, it sounds like he making an excuse for whenever, if he loses, he can say that that's why he lost. It ain't that Javante just outclassed him. It ain't that he's just a much more skilled fighter, the better man at the end of the day. Nah, it's because of a rehydration clause. And I feel him on that. You know what I'm saying? It's like, bruh, you signed the papers, so you was cool with the deal. Why even bring it up in the first place? And better yet, the thing about it is, Javante got to do the same exact thing that he doing. What's the problem? What it probably is, is, like I said, whenever he was going through training camp, it was probably a little bit hard for him to make weight, or he just really wasn't feeling comfortable. He don't look like he in bad shape. He looked pretty good to me, Ryan Garcia. So hopefully, man, this rehydration clause, just it, it gets over and done with because ain't nobody going to be talking about it during the fight. They might be talking about it, but it's not going to be such an issue where wh whoever wins or loses, that they're going to talk about it. You know what I mean? So, yeah, man, I agree 100% with Calvin Ford. Hey, man. I don't want to hear nothing about no rehydration clause, win or lose. Leave it alone.